most common questions we get asked is how to choose the perfect white paint. This house is a total whiteout, so let me show you how we made our choices. Now it's time to choose the inside. We want something fresh and bright. So I've painted these big swatches here. The bigger the better. And as much as you'll be tempted to start making your decision straight away, you have to wait. Go away, come back and do the second coat, look at it in all different lights before you make your final decision. And guys, it's really easy to get confused about which white is which on your wall. So a trick is to make sure you actually paint the colour underneath. So this is natural white. So I'm just going to put an N here so we all remember that this one was natural white. So this natural white is definitely throwing a bit more cream because it's a warm white. The Lexicon half is really cool and it's what I've got in my home. And then we've got the white on white, which is also a cool white, but it's a little bit cleaner, a little more minimalist. And that's the white we're gonna go with for this home where we really wanna make it fresh inside. We're gonna have warmer flooring, so we wanna cool it down on the walls. That's a little bit creamier. Yes. That is a little bit whiter and it's got some greater yes. tone. Yes. Yeah. And then that again is that even more so, it's a little bit more creamier than that. Sophie's actually looking for a little bit more of a crisper white. I think the winner of the this exterior is. What's it called? Casper White Quarter. Oh, Casper White. Casper Water. White Quarter's winner. So, as you can see, we chose two different whites for this home. Inside, we had White on White by Dulux and outside, Casper White Quarter by Dulux. One of my personal favourites. It's got a bit of grey, but not too creamy. It creates the perfect contrast to this beautiful, lush landscape around us. Do you have a favourite white? Tell us in the comments below.